Hi everyone, um, just thought I'd play one last game in um, 2011, one last video. Just be a drunk cocktail rather fast, so I'm going to play absolutely terrible, so it's because you're facing low rated. Now what's the theory? I think it's d5, I'm not sure. Oh, it's an exchange thing I'll take with the queen, that's all I can think of. Um, bleh, knight of six. Well, I can have to stay upright. Whoa, this is kind of crazy. Um, what's the theory? I think it's knight c6, but that's probably horribly wrong, so I can't think of myself. Anyway, um... <laughs> I think he's supposed to finish out actually. But yeah, I did drink this cocktail rather fast, but it was really nice. I'm mean, gonna move to hack up. Probably shouldn't be playing chess like this. <laughs> I play very aggressively when I had a drink. <laughs> it's a random cheap heart attack. <laughs> Put the bishop there, I'll probably trap my own queen, which is rather oh, stupid. If you have got to go to um, A5. God, I can't afford it at all. <laughs> This is terrible. <laughs> Where's my queen going? <laughs> terrible. I'll put it on A4. It'd be nice to get the queens off because my queens aren't about any squares. It's kind of a bit annoying. I can hardly think. You shouldn't have drunk it that fast. <laughs> Last video of 2011, though, I thought I'd make it funny. Got amazing lag here. Sweating some lag. For 252 videos in just 6 months is pretty impressive, especially seeing as I didn't do any for about 3 months. Got sweating videos, so improving all your chess. I hope you appreciate it. Be a nice new yes present for loads of you to subscribe, I'd really appreciate that. Get rid of this bishop because it's annoying me. Like it's fucking pissing me off. <coughs> <laughs> anyway, if it takes, I'll have an open G file for a rook, and I'll probably cast along and get hacked up. Oh, I'm gonna go down after this game, I think, and watch um, New Year, New Year celebrations, and maybe have a bit more food, spend some time with family. Pretty epic. That's in a bad move actually, because taking is bad for him. Should I castle? I think I've got a castle long now and try and hack him up on with an pawn storm. Play him rather aggressive. Too aggressive, in fact. We've got amazing lag again. Try and shut some mash or some tabs down. I help. What's it going on here? It's not even moving at all. Oh, he's off of the draw. Well, I'm not going to accept, of course, because he's a lot lower rated. Although I'm not in much of a condition to play, so I probably should have accepted and took my lost points, cut my losses. Ugh, castle long. Oh. I'll take. That's all I can think of. Just a take. And then, but with this knight. And then play rook g8, I don't even get why he took because I've got this g file to work with. And then bishop c6 and g2 is going to come under serious pressure. But now he's taking a sports spot trying to get the queens off. Well, that's accepted because my queens haven't got any squares. And now, I don't care if he plays bishop takes d5, I'm going to play bishop c6! Exclamation mark. But then he's got a knight a5, which is a very <coughs> annoying move because I can't think of more than one move ahead. And that's kind of scupping my chances of winning this game. However, I'll try and think of a position. I've got a doubled pawn, but in return, I've got a bishop against a knight in an open position and pressure on g2 potentially. In fact, I'm going to utilize it straight away for any book takes g2, which hopefully I'll miss. In fact, it's just completely missed that I can take an f3 anyway. But if it takes my book off now, I have to take with king because otherwise, um, I'd look their pin would be broken. I've not missed that, am I? Come on. I may have had a cocktail, but one, you don't know I've had a cocktail, and two, I'm not going to miss it, am I? I'll take it with a rook, and then um, forking two pawns. This is practically already resignable, and that's why I don't accept the draw, because you're a patsy. Except that move's kind of annoying, so I've got to retreat the bishop. Oh, 
cracking my fingers. Nice feeling. Nice enter 2011, um, I think it is. At the year, was it 19 summit? No, it's 2011. Now he's going to lose a pawn. He's going to lose a H pawn on the G pawn. He's going to lose his dignity. Oh, he's just attacking my bishop again. He's sweating attacking my bishop. Should have gone back to d5 in first place. But I didn't expect him to start harassing my bishop like this. And now he can protect his pawns with um, rook e2. But if he was rook e2, maybe I can play f3, double exclamation mark. In fact, f3, double exclamation mark looks like a strong move in a position. Hacking it up. I'm going to have a massive feast after this. I think I'm proper starving, man. And I've had um, these cocktails putting me proper hungry in it. I just swap the rooks off. I should, oh, I should, why would I play F3? Why would I, I just forgot something which I said about two seconds ago. Didn't know my memory was that bad. I can't check my bishop because I've always got bishop B1. God, why am I gaggling on so much? Why didn't I just resign? Ugh. Right, anyway. Retreat the bishop to the. He's thinking of a way to win it. So I wrote, I wrote three pawns up for a start. Bring the king in. Well, anyway, fans and subscribers, I hope you've enjoyed um, your year, new year. My new year's resolution, by the way, is to get like thousands of subscribers and make Epic Chess into something big. And if you subscribed, you would be helping me achieve that. And I would love you a lot, and you'd be helping me accomplish my new year's resolution. So, um,. Thank you very much if you've subscribed and please continue to get more people to subscribe to this amazing channel. Oh shit. <laughs> Stopping that B5. Says, oh ouch. Why did I drop my king back? That's just so stupid. I've got a plan. I'll, sa I'll tempo sacrifice a pawn. I've just blundered. But the king of pawn games have got to be winning for me. That's got to be waiting for me, so I'm a couple of pawns up for a start. No a6. Should have gone a5, that was stronger, but he's not on the to hold this pawn. That's the thing. Take this. And then I'll preview him to death. His mouse behind him, race. I need to put. Oh, I do you put auto promote to a queen? Someone put in this, the comments, please. How do you I put it working automatically promote to a queen? I've done play king takes f6. Oh, I stopped queen. Finger check. I use this check instead. So that should do it. I've got to get that other pass pawn. Check. Check. Protecting my C7 pawn as well. It's not resigned. Check. Should do it. Check. God, if that pawn was advanced a further rank, one further rank, it'd actually be a draw. Well, I don't think well, that is my king's close enough, but I'm just pointing out it's a bishop's pawn, and we know in queen versus pawn that a bishop's pawn is usually a draw. But anyway, put this game to bed now. Checkmate. I've had a cocktail and you still got owned. No, I'm going down to watch New Year and now I'm not playing you again, sorry. But anyway, so a quick look through the game if I can do. So I played my queen takes d5 double exclamation mark line, you played about a harmless line against it. Because if you play queen takes d5 exclamation mark question mark, you should either play c4 or knight c3, they're like the only challenges, knight f3 is nothing. Just upload this epic video. It's quite a lot through it, nothing too exciting, just grind him down in the end game. Just play blunders there. I probably could have played better moves like... I think it was F3 double exclamation mark was a more quicker win, but now this pawn's actually going to be invincible because even when he actually um, wins it, that the king of pawn games just winning and this temporary pawn stack just seals the win, and then no point looking at rest. Check. 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 Check me. Anyway, before I close this video, I must say one thing. Fans, I hope you have a very happy new year. And, um, yeah, very happy new year to all of you. You amazing subscribers. And please leave any comments and thoughts for the final video in 2011. Thanks very much.